wide shot first, so if you can sit alone on the furthest part of that bench. Just like right at the end of here? Yeah. Or in the middle? Just like right at the end. I know that I'm like, this is like a great dancing, but like, how do you want me to act it? Right, okay, so obviously how you're stood now is how it should start. You're sort of just staring into nothing, right? Mm -hmm. um, and then as the scene goes on, you slowly sort of start to sink back against the wall. Um, and the lower down you go, you start quietly breaking down rather than it being excessive and more like audible. Yeah, yeah. Um, we sort of want it to be this uncomfortable sort of breakdown. Go okay, so... I don't need to be holding this. <laughs> Do you mind holding up now? Sorry, thank you. So, I just want you to walk down the stairs looking straight ahead the whole time. Just um, as you Yeah, and go really slowly. I'm just going to track you from behind at this like mid to wide level, staying at this distance. And then I'm going to go here and get a wide shot. Just like right at the end of So I was thinking for this shot, especially when we actually do it, we could set up the camera on a tripod um, and we get just one shot of the mirror empty um, and then obviously we get the shot where you're looking into it and you wash your face so you can't see your reflection and then I was thinking maybe we could um, mask that so we cut out the shape of the mirror and then, yeah. and then replace it because that should work in theory, yeah, right? Yeah, I know what you mean. Um, I'll just have to learn how to do that when editing but yeah. I can watch videos and that's going to be part of my research. Yeah, cool. Again, we want to show that sort of disconnect, but we also want to show that you don't really care. Without seeing your face, it sort of emphasises that, that, yeah. that you're as disconnected to yourself as you are the rest of the world, and the audience should feel that way too. So, uh, action, yeah? Of, um, sort of represent that shot that we actually have in the script. Um, obviously, you're sat there now, and obviously in the film there's the scene where uh, where Jane is sat on her dinner table, so I'm going to get a kind of a wide shot um, of you sat in the room there, and then I think I'm going to get an extreme close up of your eyes. Uh, the further you go down, sort of cover your face, because we want we want the audience to sort of just have that implication of what's going on in your head. We don't want to show it. We don't want dialogue to prove anything we want it, them to interpret as it is and obviously with the other stuff that we see in the film um, of you dealing with addiction and stuff I think it makes a lot of sense for you to be more quiet oh, yeah. about it so they can interpret it like that so like as you lower down eventually your hands go over your face and then by the time that you're fully on the floor you're just quietly weeping so just muffled sobs mm -hmm. you know it's not very yeah i think i know what you mean yeah okay cool so we can try it like that yeah, and if you don't get it we can do it again <laughs> 